to be honest, where I'm from, Milton Keynes, I was a minority growing up, like massively. I've been shouted at for being a, you know, oh, this packy here, blah, 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 whatever. It happens to me. And it, when I was growing up, it became such a regular thing that it was just like, oh, whatever, just ignore it. Whenever we get show offers, wherever we, where, wherever it is, the first thing I think of is, shit, where am I going? Will there be other like people like me there? I guess it can be intimidating at times in some of the places that you go to. Every now and again you do do meet nut jobs that, that just don't understand. <laughs> yeah, touring definitely does open your eye up to a lot of that. It it's already a niche as it is, we shouldn't be making it difficult for people to come into that niche uh, by having other opinions that don't make any sense. And, and I do get messages every now and again on Facebook or Instagram where other people from different countries like India messaging me saying, oh, it's so good to see an Indian guy in British metal like being being in a band that we love. And I was just like, awesome, like, thanks. Hopefully in the next 10 years, we'll be having a different conversation about this and be like, do you remember what it used to be like? Now look. I mean, I, th I feel that it is maybe slightly going that way in some places because I'm in Milton Keynes and I'm in London. You know, London's great everyone's welcome usually in, into a gig or a venue where, wherever you play in London. It's very diverse.